Hi, everyone, and welcome to the first and hopefully the only virtual girls day at the State House. My name is Sarah Gideon, and I'm the speaker of the main House of Representatives. Normally, we'd be seeing each other in person at the State House. I'd be looking at all of your smiling faces in your green shirts, and you would be off to an amazing adventure in the hallways and the rooms of the State House and the Cross Building. But today, I know that all of the people at the Maine Women's Lobby are making a day still very special for you, with Girls' Day at the State House being virtual. And I just wanted to take this moment to welcome you and to share a little bit about my own story and how I became involved at the State House and in public service. You see, I actually always believed that government and making policy was the way that we could change people's lives and make people's lives better. But I never really expected to be an elected official myself. In fact, I found myself one day coming home and hearing a message that somebody left on our answering machine, not for me, but for my husband, Ben, asking if he would consider running for the town council in our hometown of Freeport. And I'll tell you, girls, I heard that message and I thought, I totally agree that Ben is great, but actually I think that that is the right job for me and I think it's really a place where I can make a difference. Now, that was about 11 years ago, and since then, I have served on our town council. I did run for that seat in Freeport, and I then went on to run for the state house. I became a state representative. I served as the assistant leader in our Democratic House Caucus, and now I've been speaker of the main house for four years, and I'm also running for United States Senate. And I share that with you because what I learned was that if, number one, you're willing to listen to the people around you, but two, if you are always willing to put people first and to listen, even to the people that you think you disagree with the most, it's always possible to get things done. Now, we've been doing a lot of great work in the State House that I'm proud of, but there is one thing that I think needs so much more work that maybe some of you are even experiencing today amidst coronavirus. And that's making sure that no matter where we live in the state of Maine, we have access to high-speed internet and broadband. I don't know what it's like for you these days learning from home and doing all online and virtual learning, but I expect it has many, many challenges. One challenge we don't want any kid in this state to face is that idea that they cannot actually do their studying and homework because they don't have proper access to broadband and internet. So my challenge for you all today is to think about the things that are going on in your lives, in your friends and family lives, in your communities, and to think about what is the one thing that you want to change and make a difference in, and how can you do it? Because I want you to know that I believe in you and I know that the change in the world that we need is yours to make. So I can't wait to see you in person. I hope you are doing well, staying safe and healthy, and I'm wishing you the very best on this girl's day. Take good care. Bye-bye.